another option offensively for them. And the same will be Payne, the two Launceston players that we haven't really mentioned in this starting five. As we see Dickie Stroutman gets underway for the Hawks with a nice little mid-range jumper. But she's ready to make amends for that performance. Stroutman for three. Didn't even hesitate after missing the last and she buries a big shot. And that's really important to get her going, Kenny. Do you think the coaching staffs are having a battle on who can not who sub at all? Can sub the least. Well, the only one sub has been made by Ringwood, and here she is on cue. Danny Allen steps into a big three, and that experience is going to be crucial for the Hawks. But you can't allow your team to get lackadaisical on the other two players out there on the floor. Yeah, and it's a really hard balancing act. Strout Manet, nice little hesitation on the left hand. She took it right to Mariana Tolo. Ball's kicked to the opposite wing, though. Here's Griffin. As we said, yet to score. Yeah. It was good defense from Trotto, and Stratman came over the top as well, Kenny. Oh, that was excellent defense by the Hawks, no doubt. And it ends up in a layup at the other end. Uh, that they're shooting about 25% from the field, if, if, if that's some indication of what's happened. Oh, brilliantly run play, and Diggy Stratman steps into an open layup, and the lead's out to 16. Kelsey Griffin still yet to score in this game. Guarded by Farmworth. Here's Payne. She gets blocked by Diggy Stroutman, eh? The Hawks' defense. And almost a turnover from Launceston. Entry pass to Trotto. Little hurried scoop layup. She got it up before Griffin could play the help D. And so we ring it back the other way. They lead by 15. Hamida, kick. Stroutman, eh? Triple. Hey. Butter from Diggy Stroutman, eh? The body language for the Hawks has really changed. They've really got to get back to being aggressive. And that sort of disappeared from their game. Heads have dropped. Stroutman, she wanted that three. That whole time, Hamida was dribbling the ball down the floor. 